Okay, so to the brain. Uh, I feel good. The sulky or the sulcus are all the indentions. The gyri or the gyrus are all the, you know, whatever you call bumps. There you go. Median sulcus goes right down the middle of it. Uh, cerebral hemispheres. This is the cerebellum. Spinal cord. Whenever you look inside it, you have the superior and inferior colliculus or colliculi, I guess, if you're talking about both of them. Um, there's two hemispheres of this you have to know. One is the vermis, and that's, I can't remember. I believe that's the middle, right? Vermis and the third one. Yeah, the vermis is the middle. And then the two outer. Cerebellar. No, there's, there's one that starts with an F. It's in the, it's in this paper if someone has clean hands. <laughs> oh, and the uh, superior and inferior colliculi together make up the uh, corpus gemin something. Geminera, I think. All right, so. That's all too far. Of course, the corpus is inside. Yeah, the fornix. Fornix is inside. Fornix is the bottom There's part. Very Maybe I'm just. Yeah. See, my problem is I've been doing all the pictures online, so I can't remember what's from the pages and what's from. I'll be able to understand. So they just have vermis. Okay. Mm -hmm. Then you don't have to know. Just... All right. And then the connect all the stuff that was kind of holding the two cerebral hemispheres together. The was the um, it starts with a C. Corpus callosum. Uh, corpus callosum. And on the inside, the corpus callosum is just the top part of this. It's easier to see here. So the corpus callosum is the top. Uh, the actual gap in here is the uh, lateral ventricle. Okay. Uh, the solid part in there is called the septum pellucidum. Uh, these, the first bump up here is the optic chiasm. Obviously this part back here is the medulla oblongata and the spinal cord. Uh, the arbor uh, vitae. And then in between that's the cerebellar cortex. Is that what it's called? Um, you have your superior and inferior colliculus. Uh, this is the massa intermedia. And around. None of ours had it. That one people did, but the mass that was in there is called the. Uh, I'll start with the CH. Yeah. I know it's in the paper. I just. Uh, it's called the. Oh, that's what I was trying to think of. Corpora quadrigemina is the superior and inferior. The stuff inside it's um, really reddish color. Yeah. That's what produces the fluid that bathes the spinal. I think it's called cordae. Radix or something like that. Choroid plexus? Yeah. Choroid plexus. It's, it's like this red kind of spider net looking thing that goes in there. Um, what else do have to know? The cerebral peduncles are these kind of large structures. And then on the side it's the piriform lobes. Um, the pawns would be these two things. So, see how there's this kind of lateral section right here? Mm -hmm. Those are called the trapezoids. And then this is the medulla oblongata. Um, this is the olfactory bulb, olfactory tracts, and then you have lateral and medial olfactory stria. So lateral and medial. Mm. The mammillary bodies are these two things. They're kind of torn up on this one. <coughs> the optic nerve. Optic nerve is goes off from here. This is the optic chiasm. It usually it usually forms an X, right? Yes. Yeah. So the optic nerve would go off like right there and like right there. Gotcha. The piriform lobe. Yeah, piriform lobe. Yeah. Um, oh, piriform. Whatever. Oh, I thought I said cribiform. Piriform. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
piriform. Yeah. Piriform. Uh, I had no idea what that was. <laughs> I mixed yeah. up. <laughs> I was like, wow, I've never even heard of that. I think that's it. Oh no, there's the aqueduct, but you can't see it in this. The aqueduct is it's kind of this gap that would run down. Uh, oh, the right here, going up in, is the interventricular septum. Or, is it interventricular in this still? I thought that was like the... Um, yeah. Interventricular, yeah, it's called, it's still called interventricular septum, right? And then the hypothalamus is this darker area right here. And wait, what, what is this, like, inner... The, it, well, you only have to know spinal cord and then the, the fact that the aqueduct goes down right here. But it's not really dug out on this. Oh, and the medulla oblongata. So the third ventricle, or the hypothalamus. Yeah, so third ventricle, as you ever see on this? Yeah, a little. So the third ventricle is kind of where this gap is, and it would just go up and basically empty around the massa intermedia. Okay. And the fourth ventricle, ventricle is also called the lateral, or that's the first is also called mm -hmm. the lateral. Fourth is back here. Yeah, but we don't have to know. Yeah. Okay. Mm -hmm. That's it.